Actually, dalawang laser ho ang ginagamit doon. Yung isa pang mm-hmm. photocoagulate para ho mag, mag-clump up yung iris. And another one is the YAG laser, which actually makes the hole, no? Pinapaklump up namin para hindi ho maging uh, bloody yung uh, yung laser uh-huh. iridotomy. So that's, in one procedure, two lasers to ang ginagamit po namin, no? And then there are other lasers in glaucoma, no? So sabag ito natin yung glaucoma. Ang tinatawag po yung ano, selective laser trabeculoplasty, tinitira po yung daanan ng tubig para lumuwang. Okay? And sometimes it uh, it uh, replaces uh, or as a starter, imbis na gamot, laser muna kung bagong diagnose ng glaucoma because some studies show na mas effective yung long-term treatment niya. No? So, at meron rin po, ginagamit rin po yung YAG laser, minsan kung halimbawa uh, post-operatively yung tahi medyo mahigpit, kaya ko putulin ng laser yung yung suture. Uh, laser uh-huh. suture lysis po ginagamit doon. So, marami hong purposes yung laser at we have to discuss in the background of uh, indication tsaka yung mga expectation ng pasyente, no? tsaka yung any intention ng doktor. So, maraming laser po sa glaucoma. Okay. Hmm. Interesting. Ako naman, Doc Vic, no? gusto ko nang malaman yung mga benefits siguro ng laser compared dun sa surgery. Ano-ano yung mga benefits niya? Mas mabilis ba yung healing time niya? Lesser yung pain? At ano po ba yun? Okay. Ang pinaka... It's actually it's actually like magic, no? You exert tissue change without really uh-huh. touching the tissue. It's just the light that that ano. So yun ang pinaka for me that's one of the most non-invasive procedures in medicine. Sipin yun na lang, nasa likod yung alam mo yung retina, nasa likod siya. Eh, usually surgical ano yun? Surgical procedure yun every time you want to make an action in the retina. It's a general anesthesia, papasok certain uh, uh, instruments, uh, mahal yun, uh, uh-huh. a lot of things can happen. E kung ilalaser lang ho natin, it's an outpatient procedure. The patient goes home uh, uh-huh. after the procedure. No? So maraming ang nagtatakang pasyente, akala nila pag sinabi ko pong ilalaser sila for the diabetic retinopathy, Kala nila mag- mako-confine po sila. Well, actually, Oo, it's, a, it's a 10-minute procedure. Hindi nakakala ako, ah. Outpatient. Oh, 10-minute procedure. Outpatient siya. Mm-hmm. Most of the procedures I discussed, actually all. All procedures that I've discussed are all outpatient procedures. Except when you use a laser as part of a surgery, no? Pero most of the time, yun po ang, ano, no? uh, it's an outpatient procedure. Uh, minimally invasive. Pero, pero Doc yes. Vic, yung mga tao, kasi pagka narinig na, laser, naku, mahal yan, naku Doc, baka hindi ko kaya. How true yan, Doc? <laughs> <laughs> Actually, po po. po. <laughs> Opo. <laughs> Kung may kamahalan ho ng, ng kaonte, no? it depends from person to person. Pero dapat i-consider nyo rin po, na babawiin ho nung doktor or nung center, yun pong napaka mahal that turns into the millions. Uh-huh. It turns into the mm-hmm. millions and the way, only way to recoup it mm-hmm. is to charge accordingly. No? Hindi naman po pwede kasi okay. sabihin namin mababa, eh, kailangan libo-libo kong pasyente para mabawi yung laser, which is not actually practical. Mm-hmm. But for the value that it gives to the patient, uh, you get I what think you pay for. It, no? Yes, oh, you get what you pay for. Pero, Mm-hmm. Meron din naman pong mga, ano po, dahil po gold standard na po yung laser, these lasers are actually part of uh, government hospitals. And also, for like, in our situation, a uh, private hospital with uh, with the charity arm. So, hindi na po ganun kamahal po ang mga, ano po, ano, ang mga cost of lasers. That's very good to hear, no? Doc Vic, ano, ano po ba yung maipapayo, nyo, maipapayo ninyo sa ating mga kababayan? No? Whenever they hear the word laser, na may gagamitin kayong mga ganyang instrumento sa kanila, sa kanilang mata, ay naiintimidate. Ano ho ba yung mga dapat nyong ipayo? Doon sa mga naiintimidate, sa mga natatakot, no? Bukod pa doon sa presyo na talagang parang alam mo yun, tumataas na yung balahibo, na parang gusto nang umurong ng paa, umalis na. 
Yes, yes. Because uh, it reminds me of a saying that no, eh, we only fear what we do not understand. So, ano ang remedyo dyan? Eh, magtanong po kayo para maintindihan nyo kung ano yung gagawin. Yes. Kasi po, <laughs> kasi, alibawa po, alibawa, alibawa, computer, eh, hindi pa po ako nakakahawak ng computer ng bata ko. Talagang takot ako noon. Diba? Until you know how it really works, you okay. sit down, go through the details, ask for the indication. Ba- bakit po natin gagawin to? Kailangan po ba natin gawin dito? Kung hindi natin gawin to, ano ang mangyayari? Kung gawin natin to, mm-hmm. ano ang mangyayari at ano yung ibang mga komplikasyon? Kasi kahit laser po, may mga komplikasyon rin. Kaya kailangan mm-hmm. dyan, kailangan tanongin nyo rin yung doktor kung ano yung experience niya doing this particular laser procedure, no? So, kung medyo, ano, uh, well, if, if he doesn't give you a fair answer, Eh, it, it's a it's a free country, no? You can go shopping to another doctor kung hindi okay satisfied sa question nyo. The worst we can do as patients is, ano, no? Just yeah. accept everything. Na, mm-hmm. ay, sabi ng doktor ko, ganito. So, ito yung gagawin ko. Pero, mm-hmm. in fact, most of the doctors like to explain. Kasi, para mapaliwanag. Kasi pag sinabi laser, ang, ang hirap po kasi, pag sinabing mahal at high-tech, They think it's infallible. Kala nila, mm-hmm. basta ni laser, wala nang mm-hmm. oh, oh. Ano to, perfect na perfect na po. No? Ano po? Nothing wala is perfect daw. in this world. No matter mm-hmm. how expensive, no matter how yes. high-tech, wala hong perfect. But it, it approximates perfection na po eh. Kasi hindi mo ginagalaw. And you're exerting mm-hmm. tissue action on the eye. No? So maganda po itong invention na mga lasers na ito po. What about, hindi ko alam kung natanong nyo na, no? yung patungkol dun sa, may mga do's and don'ts ba tayo before a surgery and after the laser ano po, uh, procedure? Well, yun ang kagandahan ng laser po, no? Once the action is done, wala na hong, ano, hindi na hong siya aalagaan. Kasi, whatever Maliwana has been happening just goes, goes back to normal, no? Of course, normal. there's some recovery period, hmm. alibawa, Pag nagpa-PRK tayo, laser, may konting habdi po siya, you recover for about a year. Ah, I'm sorry. A day, a day. A day, ah, a day. A day, no? <laughs> a day. A day, a day. Surgery na lang ako, baka mas mabili. <laughs> Joke lang. <laughs> uh, Magkakamali lang po. What a day. Baka masagtagal pa yung downtime uh-huh, kesa no? sa procedure, no? Uh-huh. Mabuti ni Nino ni Dr. Vick yun. Lugi na kami yeah. lahat. <laughs> so, it's about one day for PRK. If it's LASIK, Mabilis, oh. about four PC. hours. LASIK. So, yung okay, halimbawa, yes, yung, ah? yung, yes, halimbawa yung yes, halimbawa yung inaalagaan yung grado na napakataas noon, and then you undergo LASIK, In about five hours, you have perfect vision. So, wow, talaga yung mga na 2020 na ba? Yes. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Parang gusto nating oh, ma-achieve. Naman na si Clearly. 